Hey everyone, back here with another pickups video. This will be my pickups for the month of November. Uh, so the only kind of book I got this month here is the Mario Party 3 strategy guide. I got this one off eBay there. I think it was about 20 bucks for it or something like that, so it wasn't too bad there. It's a little bit rough in shape, but it's uh, something that adds my collection anyways. Uh, that's it for books there. I did pick up one CD here. I did pick up the Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. This is the game music soundtrack. Uh, I got this actually from eBay as well there. It's a two disc set there. I think it's a pretty good price, too, for two. I want to say maybe 40 or 50 bucks, not too bad for that. Uh, I did get one figure here. I got the Wave Man uh, from the Mega Man fully charged line there. So happy to add that to my collection there. Now it's going to be mostly games. Um, for the Switch, I got Empire of Angels 4. This is one of those kind of like a Black Friday kind of sales there. Uh, from I think the Video Game Plus is the store, was it there for it? It's like a turn based uh, uh, strategy game. Um, Next up, I traded to get this Nintendo 64 cleaning kit. It is in the box there and everything like that. Um, this next game here I got from uh, Best Buy as part of their also their uh, Black Friday kind of sales and stuff like that. So I got Deus Ex Mankind Divided, the day one edition. This one was like $5 for that. Got F1 2022 for the Xbox One. This one was 15 And from Walmart I did get Team Sonic Racing. This one was at $20 for that. Of the games there, I did get um, from a whatnot auction uh, uh, from uh, Chase Up Third Price. I did get Shantae and the Pirates Curse there, so I've got that to my collection there. And from Nark, I did get a Resident Evil 2 from his whatnot thing there. So this is going into my collection there. I did obviously get some other things there, but we won't show those there. But uh, that's going into my collection there. And the last things for the month are these Mega Man NES games there. Uh, so this is all basically in trade, so I didn't really pay anything, but I did end up trading in my uh, GameCube collection there. So the GameCube collection quest is, is done, really. It just became way too hard to collect for it. Everything is just skyrocketing in prices, and the, you, you know, just never came across games here otherwise, unless you want to just buy them online for exorbitant prices. So the fun of the trying to collect GameCube games died away. And I collect games that I want to collect and actually play. So anyways, this is what I did get in trade here. So. I got a box for Mega Man 2. Uh, it completes my collection there. So I got a cl complete box Mega Man 1, which I did not have. And also a complete box in like minty shape here of Mega Man 5. So pretty much now I have the whole Mega Man collection. I just need, um, the only loose one I have is Mega Man 6. I just have the cartridge for Mega Man 6 there. So maybe someday I'll get a box manual for that, but uh, happy to add these into my collection. And this kind of wraps up my pickups for the month of November. Thanks for watching.